As someone with sleep apnea, I need this mask and this machine to help me breathe at night. Whew. This is a CPAP machine. CPAP stands for Continuous Positive Airway Pressure, meaning it applies a pressure to keep the throat open at night. The CPAP includes a water reservoir that is heated up while in use to add humidity to the air you're breathing. Sometimes, however, in dry conditions, the water reservoir can run dry. Unfortunately, even though there's no water, the heater will continue to heat up. The air being pushed through the mask then rises in temperature. Eventually, you wake up completely dried out with hot air blowing into your face. It's very uncomfortable and a bad thing to wake up to. Using an in-room humidifier can help, but it isn't foolproof. I've designed something to help solve this problem. This device is essentially a weight scale. Weight is measured by use of a load cell. The idea is to continually monitor the weight and trigger an alarm when the water falls below a certain level. Multiple measurements are taken to ensure random fluctuations or events don't have a big impact. The value that is to be compared to the alarm weight is a 10 value moving average. Each of the 10 moving average values is taken from the average of 5 measurements. In total, the value being compared to the alarm weight is the result of 50 separate measurements. Two calibration buttons exist to store min-max weights in the EEPROM, meaning they will be stored even once power is removed. One button stores the weight of the scale with no water in the reservoir, and one button stores the weight of the value with the reservoir full. These values are used with the desired water percent remaining to determine the alarm weight. If the empty weight set is larger than the full weight, an error sound is played. The device will not go into measurements as long as this is the case. A success sound is played if the full weight is more than the empty weight. The mask hanger allows the device to know when the mask is in use or not. Measurements will only begin once the mask is off the hanger and the calibration values are logical. Each new measurement is added to the moving average, and this value is compared to the alarm weight value. As water is removed from the reservoir, the moving average slowly decreases with each new value moving into the array, pushing out the oldest value. The program is set up to sound the alarm with 15% water remaining. The water reservoir holds 400 milliliters, so if the alarm set for 15% remaining, the alarm should sound with 60 milliliters of water left, or about one quarter cup. <laughs> 